Yo, what's up, what's up, YouTube? How you doing? This is your boy, QS Mars 4K Tech. And on this episode, we got to do a one more review. iPhone 11 Pro Max versus the iPhone 11. And this is a review that I want to do. Uh, this a experiment, but also the final review before I decided to pick up the iPhone 12 Pro Max in the 12 so i just want to give you my thoughts on these devices and so uh, so i know i will be picking them up sometime later on this year probably next year i might pick up but for now uh i gotta be grateful to have these two devices but i want to give you my honest opinion on both of these devices and what's the different from um these two devices i gotta begin you straight up real What's the different from the 11 right here versus this? So, um, this is an LCD display right here, and this is a OLED display. And OLED and SSD is like two different uh, screen tonality. That means you get better blacks on the uh, phone itself. So, I mean, I'm wrapping it off to my dust. But clearly, you get a better screen with this. Now, I feel like this is my opinion. I feel like that the screen on both of them is good. The color pop really good, but it pop better on him. Uh, that you can see clearly that the color pop more better on him. But I could love the LCD display, and it though uh, the color don't pop really well on him. This is still one of my favorite device to pick up in 2020. And so, so, yes, we know I did a review on this device on my last video. So, if you watched the last video of this, please try on my channel. Put a like or dislike. And so, so that gets back on track. So, the iPhone 11, um, I not been in specs, but I got to give you all the specs. All the camera are cross board, the trail, magnetic camera, front and back. All of them could do 4K 60 frames. All of them, that is my best camera. Only different is from the 11, you get three cameras versus four cameras. And so, so that a bit difference, but everything is the same. Um, everything is also the same. But these two devices that is like, like the king, like this is what the best setup over this device. And a whole bunch of people went out and bought this device over this. And because this is more expensive, and this is less expensive. And what I mean that yes, it is in, in the 800s if you get the 256, but for right now, they got to drop the price down to about 400 for this. So it might be 499 or 450 for this. So I was y'all. Yeah, but I picked this device up because uh, the iPhone 12 launch came out yesterday. Pre orders came out yesterday. And next week will be the iPhone 12 and the iPhone 12 mini launch. So right now it's out on pre order. So man, I really enjoy having these phones. Now, you do got the option if you want to upgrade one phone to another phone uh, with your phone character, and depending what phone character you have. And, and depend on what deposit you have. So, um, one thing I could say about the iPhone 11 and 11 Pro that I just love the sound quality that comes with both. Both of them got the same sound quality, so you not miss out on neither of none of them. Uh, and no such thing. This is louder than this, or this is louder than this. Bolden is treated the exact same way. Bolden is equal. Another thing is with the front camera is good. Now I think that the front camera on this do a better uh, when you doing portrait. I think do a much better job than this because I noticed with the picture with the iPhone 11. Uh, yes, it may it got the same quality, but that do not mean the picture quality is the same. That just being straight real. So if we go into the camera on each one, I gotta take a picture on each one with the front camera. And you can see that do one. Okay, I wanna do 
to the black and white one. Okay, so you got one picture right here with the black and white one. Um, right here, but one that I didn't notice about the 11, it is different. And like the camera on this one, it's more sharper than what you get on here. And let me do the same thing just to be fair. And just to show you. And so, so let me go into camera real fast. And let me show you the portrait. Do one portrait mode. Okay, so this uh, I noticed a bit different from the two phones because I began to notice on him, like you can see more details in my face on him. Uh, for some reason, with the iPhone 11, the regular 11, do this. With the regular 11, it look like in the same picture, but uh, clearly, I didn't know he doing face smoothness, but you can see a bit different from when you do it um, a pair on him. That I noticed on him with the uh, fat and most sharp on the 11 versus on him. It's too smooth out on this one versus on him. You can see every details. And I'm not saying any bad thing, but little things that you have to notice on a device that the camera came out really good, the picture quality came out good, but it's not sharp enough when you're doing the front camera. So you could do this and edit it and post with a app. You could do it, bring in the sharpness, but you don't want to bring in too much sharpness. So that's what I noticed with the iPhone 11 uh, camera when you're doing push it. But uh, this is a better one right here. You want to take a really good picture picture. The sharpness is still on here. So that a little thing that I don't want to bring out. Not everybody will bring that out to you on YouTube. So, so that a little thing that I noticed about this device and this. But uh, yeah, but so far, D2 uh, could great phones. Could uh, one of the best phones that anyone should pick up in 2020. So that's the review that I want to give you a little bit of payment, not just with this. But also letting you know the sound quality is still the same on here. Like if you really want to get down to specs, you know, I want to go to uh new set. New set. And so so if we go into uh where is it where you at buddy? Go to the link, go to my album. All this. Okay, so I go right here and I want to play, like, I want to play this sound right here. Turn this up. As you can see right here. I gotta do this over here. And this is why right here. I do this. You can see the difference. Did what I noticed the difference. So, um, you can hear the bass. Listen and listen to this. This more louder. Let me show. I think this is more clearer. Like the sound quality is more clear on here. Way clear. You can see the difference. You can hear the bit difference. The 
bass is good. I hear on him. Way lighter. Way clearer. Yeah. Yeah, this is a better one where I am versus this. Cause you can hear it. This got bass play and I got the level of bass what this is. And it's just a little stuff that uh, I noticed um, about each device. So you have to listen to each device and pair it. You know, I would say that the speaker is the same. Um, it's not really true. The speaker is not the same. It totally, totally different speaker on each one of them. And part of the 11 Pro in this is the same. But when it comes to the Pro Max, it's totally different with the Pro Max. So I just want to end the video and tell you, please subscribe on my YouTube channel. I really need subscribers uh, to bring out more videos and more contents like this and do a payment on each devices. So please um, subscribe on my channel. Please put a like or a dislike. It doesn't matter to me. Long I am doing my tap, but I hope it be a good like. So please put a thumbs up and please try on my channel up here or down below on a link.